how to resize product image for Shopify. Hi guys, a warm welcome back to our channel and today we have a topic that holds immense significance for every online store owner, resizing product images for Shopify. The visual appeal of your product images can make or break a sale, making it essential to master the art of resizing. And this comprehensive guide will walk you through the steps, tools and best practices for ensuring your product images are perfectly sized and beautifully presented on your Shopify store. So let's not waste any time and dive right into this essential knowledge. But before we delve into the nitty gritty of image resizing, let's understand the profound impact it can have on your online store. Properly sized images significantly contribute to the loading speed of your website, enhancing user experience and improving your website's performance. Furthermore, aesthetically pleasing and appropriately sized images create a sense of professionalism and trust among potential customers, ultimately boosting your sales. So it always has an effect on your sales if you resize your images perfectly. So the first step in resizing a product image is determining the ideal dimensions. Shopify recommends a square space aspect ratio 2048 and 2048 pixels. And for a seamless display across various devices, striking the right balance between image quality and the file size is vital to ensure your images look sharp and appealing without compromising on website loading speed. So always determine the right image dimensions, that is, the recommendation of Shopify it's 2048 into 2048. But if it is still up to you that you can choose the right image and the Shopify's store's product size. So for example, if you want to edit the size of any of the store products that you have uploaded on Shopify, there's a multitude of tools available to assist you in resizing your product images. Industry standard software like Adobe Photoshop, user-friendly tools like Canva, Tiny PNG can make your resizing process a breeze. And in this video, our first priority will be editing with Shopify and second will be using Canva due to its intuitive interface and accessibility catering to a wide range of users. Now let's delve into the practical aspect and demonstrate how to resize your image using Shopify. So first of all, go to your Shopify store. Make sure you come to Shopify.com and log into your store. And here, simply after coming to Shopify's dashboard, click on the online store option right here. And after that, this page will appear that is things. And in here, come to this three dotted icon just after craft and just to the left of customize. Click on this button and click on edit code. After coming to edit code, we'll have to go to the filters, go to the search option at the top left corner and type in section main product. Make sure you type in exactly what I'm typing here that is section dash main dash product and hit enter. After that you will see that you have this option right under assets. So under assets you will see section main products dot CSS. So make sure it is a CSS file and after opening it you will see a lot of CSS code right here and it's a very lengthy code. But you don't need to explore all the code right here because it will be very lengthy to find anything here. So I will show you a trick in order to find what I'm going to find. So we basically have to find wrapper. So wrapper in here will be used for editing the size of our image. So hold down CTRL plus F on your keyboard. Make sure you click anywhere on this page. So I've clicked here and my cursor appears here. So after that, hold down CTRL and F and you will see this find and replace bar just at the bottom of your screen. And in here, type in wrapper and hit enter and click on next. So make sure you find the wrapper that has this media screen written on the top of it. So it is on the line 55 in my case, it can be on, it can be on some other line in your CSS code. So make sure you type in wrapper and click on next until you find the wrapper that has this code on the top of it. It will be written as at the rate media screen and mid width 990 pixels. So here is the max width of my product. So this will be basically the product size. And if you want to increase your product size, basically to resize it, if you want to increase it, 
type in any number that is bigger than 65 if you want to decrease it just type in any number that is less than 65 so for example we'll go with 50 and click on save button right here and here also in the width calc enter the same percentage that we have entered in the max width so make sure you enter the same percentage in both of these fields and click on save after you click on save we'll see this prompt that says asset saved and then we'll go back exit this and click on view your store and here we can see that we have successfully resized and decrease the product size on our Shopify store. You can see right here the area around this product is much larger than previously. Previously it was 65 and we have decreased it to 50. So there is a very slight difference that is of nearly 15% and 15% decrease looks best for my product. So if you want to resize it for your product, enter any value in the CSS code that I've shown and your product will be resized using this. And that was one way to do it. Another way is just go to your browser and type in canva.com and here simply come to canva.com, click on login or sign up and create an account on Canva, login to your Canva and after that you will have a lot of templates and resizing tools in order to edit your product image and resize it anyhow you want. So this way basically includes going to Canva and resizing your image as a whole and coming back to Shopify, coming to products and here simply click on add product or just edit this product right here, change the picture of this product and your product will be resized again with this trick. So this was the second way for using Canva and uploading your product image already resized. So these were basically the two ways through which you can resize your product on Shopify. And after uploading it's essential to preview the image of your store to ensure it appears exactly desired. If necessary, you can make additional adjustment with Shopify, allowing you to fine tune the image for the perfect look that captivates your audience. And before we conclude, let's share some expert tips for optimizing your product images. Always use high resolution images to showcase your products in the best light. Employ image compression techniques without compromising quality using tools like TinyPNG and maintain a consistent aspect ratio throughout your product. Catalog for a cohesive and professional aesthetic. And there you have it dear viewers. Resizing your product images for Shopify is a fundamental step in ensuring your online store exudes professionalism and allure. By following these steps and incorporating these best practices, you are on the right track to make your product stand out in the vast world of online commerce. If this tutorial has been beneficial for you, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more insightful tips and tricks. We are here to support you on your journey to Shopify success. Until next time, happy selling and see you in the next video. Bye bye.